welcome back to another video of mine so today i will be sharing with you guys a very easy and simple recipe as you can see i'm going to share some jalapeno poppers with you guys but um on this one i will be using my air fryer so as you can see i have um the jalapenos and they're pretty big it's better for you to to choose them this size um because you can stuff them up really good with whatever ingredients you're going to add to it um, so my ingredients here is going to be the original cream cheese, as you can see, this one, and I do have some mixed, um, cheese, and of course our bacon, because we are going to wrap these up. These are going to come out so good, and do not worry, they're not going to be spicy, it's, you're going to be able to enjoy it as long as you take the seeds out, so that's what we're going to do. So, make sure you watch the full video and don't forget to give this video a like and make sure you guys are subscribed so you guys can keep um commenting and sharing my videos and all that good stuff so let's get started rinse my jalapenos really good next we're going to open our cream cheese and have your bacon ready so we can wrap them up okay we have our bacon ready here already rinsed the jalapeno so what we're going to do is we're going to cut them in half and take the seeds out so i have cut them up and we're going to take the seeds out so here it gave me about four jalapenos just um, by using two so that's what we're going to do um we're going to leave the stem it's okay to leave it or you could cut them off so now we're just going to take the seeds off so I'm just using a spoon and I'm just trying, um, taking the, the seeds and the vein, obviously, and putting them aside. Just like that. Um, you could use gloves if you don't want to, um, touch the, the seeds because I know they're going to be very spicy. Um, so like this one, I have to take it out with the knife. And just scrape the seeds out. I am going to rinse them off again after I'm done doing this process. So that's the process for every jalapeno that you're doing. And we're just going to take them out. Okay guys, um, I rinsed them off. So make sure you rinse them off afterwards after you take out the seeds and the veins of the jalapenos. Now I'm just going to um, add my cream cheese on in them so we're just going to spread that spread it in there as much as you can like this and we're going to add some cheese like this i know i'm going to be making a mess but that's not a problem i'll clean up afterwards okay so we're going to add the cheese over it and next process will be our bacon. So we're just gonna start right here and wrap it. And wrap it as much as you can. You can see, okay. So we're just gonna wrap it like this. And we're gonna do the same thing to each of our jalapenos. Very easy to do. And they're going to be good. They're not going to be spicy. Like I said, as long as you take the seeds out, you guys will be fine. And to add the cheese, this it's optional if you want to add cheese. If not, you could just add the um, cream cheese. So we're going to do the same thing. Right here. So we can wrap it up. Like this. And then go around. like that this is how they are looking right now so um 
you could put sticks on them or without sticks. I'm going to try to do them without sticks um, since I am going to put them in the air fryer. Uh, so we are going to put the temperature for 300 degrees and we're going to leave them in there for like maybe 13 to 15 minutes. But I will be checking up on them to see how they are doing. So that's going to be our next process, guys. We're going to put... So here's my air fryer and I'm just going to put them in here. Um, I'm just going to add maybe four in here just because it's not big enough. Okay. So four of them fit in there. Now we're going to put it into the air fryer. 300 degrees for about 14 minutes. I'm going to put it for 15 minutes. So we'll um, check on that to see how it's going. So we'll be back. Hey guys, now this is how they came out. So I don't know why I said 15 minutes, but they will take about 35 minutes exactly if you want them um, the bacon this cooked. If you want a little bit more, maybe about 40, 40 minutes or 45 but mine's is perfect and they are done look how um delicious these look and smell they are really hot so i do want to try and bite one but it's too hot right now <laughs> but as you can see guys um if you guys enjoyed this video don't forget to give it a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel for more recipes i'll be showing you and yeah stay tuned for more and make sure you guys check out my previous recipes um i always leave links in my description box so you guys can just click on it and give them a like so thanks for watching guys and i'll see you guys on the next one <laughs>